Hi. Um, my hair's messy. I couldn't be bothered doing anything with it. So, yeah, I'm going to do my whole video from my recent trip to America. I got back last Sunday. It's been the longest week of my life. Work has been ridiculous. Um, but I finally have time to do a whole video. Um, let's just start with my friend's hoodie because I'm wearing it. I got this from... The Warner Bros tour that we did, I just uploaded, I think that's the last vlog before, um, and I got this, and I love it, and it's so comfy and warm, I wore it on my flight back, and it was perfect, because it's winter here now, so, it's good, it's nice and warm, so tired, anyway, let's start with what I got for my trip to America, which was this baby baby GoPro, which I, to be honest, I didn't use that much, with kind of annoyed me. I could have just got it after I went to America or whatever. Um, this is the Hero 4 Silver which has the inbuilt screen at the back. Oh, I wonder if it'll turn on. I'm using my SIM card for this for this video and it has the screen on the front. Oh Inception. I know there's no SD card. Um, it's, a, it's a really good camera but I didn't do anything actually really I just did vlogs but this will be good for our honeymoon when we go to Barakai so that's mainly what I'll be using it for so my baby baby GoPro it's so small it's really handy moving on from um, the Warner Bros stuff I've got my mug I, but I was tossing up between a friend's mug and a Harry Potter mug for so long and then decided on this one with the Hogwarts crest on it never to go a sleeping dragon and it's it's a giant mug. It's very very big. It's, I don't know how big it is. Much bigger than a regular one. I am yet to use it because I'm scared I don't want to ruin it or anything. So it's just been sitting and not used. Another Harry Potter thing I got was a wand. Of course, I could not decide for the life of me a wand to get. And Dan's like, why don't you just get this one? I was like, okay. Um, so it's a remote control wand. Um, use it for the TV. Uh, I have to like figure it out. This is what it looks like. Hello reflection. Um, so it's very it's a nice wand. I know how to turn on the TV, turn the channel over, get to the TV guide, but you have to be very precise. I've got like hair on my lips. Uh, you have to be very precise with it because it seems to be very sensitive, like if I'm trying to change the channel sometimes I'll accidentally turn it off or whatnot, but it's really good, it's really fun, it does take a while to get used to. I will be a professional wand person. You just watch. I didn't get that many clothes, I feel, but I got this really nice jacket that I love, can you see it? It's a leather jacket and this, this bit here is like suede or something, I don't really know. I don't think it's suede. But I got this for $20 at some random clothing store I found. I went into it to find a belt and I found this and I was like, oh my gosh, I need this, especially for $20. Shoes. There was a buy one, get one free sale. And I got these little wedges for like my red, because I went to America with hardly any shoes, which was really weird. So these are nice. These are very comfortable and they have a little bit of heel, so I get height with those. And I also got these sketches, which I love too. These are like my favorite. They're like so worn out already. Um, but they're like squishy inside, so it's it's they're very, very comfortable to walk in. Beauty products. So let's begin with these. Keep going, keep going. Anyway, <laughs> I got a bunch of sheet masks from H Mart. They were um, 99 cents and I was like, why not? Because we were killing time waiting for Liz to um, get home on my last day of being in San Diego. So we went there to have a look at stuff and to get some bread from Paris Baguette. Um, there's cucumber, collagen with vitamin E, green tea and aloe. There's firming and lifting. Oh, there's just those four. I just got two. Two of each and yeah, I'm excited. I haven't tried them yet, but I will try one tonight. Sunday night pampering session. Sephora. Well, this this foot with all my makeup stuff. 
that I bought. I didn't buy that much. I wish I, I, wish I bought more. I don't know why I didn't. Um, let's just start off with this MAC lipstick. It's called Speak Louder and I'm currently wearing it now. Um, I bought this for mum but she didn't want it. Cool mum. <laughs> and that's what it looks like. I really like it. It's one of the cream sheen ones. It goes on very smoothly. It's nice. Speak louder. Um, ooh, I'm excited. For, I keep forgetting to get this. This is the very first lipstick that I have ever used all the way down. And it is Clinique's A Different Grape. And I've used it so much already. It just goes with like everything. I don't know if you can even see. Oh, it's a bit darker than the other one, but I love it. It's so good. And my hair looks fabulous. Beauty Doves. Also the Clinique. Actually, I got this from Terry White today, but I'm going to put it in this haul anyway. <laughs> um, this is the Chubby Stick Intense from Clinique. They were having a relocating sale, so everything was 50% off. I really wish that I had gone there before because I really wanted to get an... Oh, I really wanted to get an Estee Lauder double wear foundation, but they only had outside beige, which was... <sighs> Breathe before you talk. <laughs> which is a really dark shade which was annoying but that's what the they're very very similar this is the one that I just did which is called roundest raspberry so they didn't have the Estee Lauder double wear I wanted so I got the Clinique even better makeup which evens and corrects in beige so hopefully this is good for me. Atisha used to use this one and said it was good so I found something in my shade so and it's something new. So why not? One thing I've also been wanting to get for ages is the Benefit Hula Bronzer. This was only $28. It's a lot smaller than I thought it would be but I swear it looks bigger on camera when other YouTubers are using it but this is it. There's a zet. And I'm really excited. I haven't used it yet because I've just been working and it comes with a little brush. I don't know if this brush is good. Um, I have my own contouring brush from Sigma, but I'll watch a few videos to see if this brush is any good. Yeah. Oh, and because it was my birthday month. No, it is. It's my birthday in a week. Um, I got my present, which is a NARS. I haven't used any of these either. Happy birthday, oh, it's not going to focus, one year boulder. And their lip products, so I'm very excited. Let's open, I haven't even opened it. So there's one very, very red one, which is a NARS in Cruella. Oh, that's going to be a pretty color. Oh, it's a pencil as well. Oh, I love this one. Why am I whispering? It's Cruella, it's this skinny one. It's a pencil that glided on so well. I love that. I want to buy a full size one. And this is a satin lip pencil in Rikukin? I don't know. This one's very, very light. Can you even see it? It's like that little thing there. Um, they're very cute. I'm, these will probably last me a while. When I go back, I'm going to get the NARS full size of this, definitely. I don't know how the staying power is, but I don't care because it has a beautiful colour. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I always, always get a bunch of these hand sanitizers from Bath and Body Works. Bath and Body Works. Um, I got Georgia Peach, Sweet Pea, which I really like, Watermelon Lemonade, Strawberry and Cupcake Sweetie. These smell so good. Um, they're always like, I think, is it 5 for 5 or 10 for 10? And then I always give some to Archie. Um, sorry, babe, I took yours home. They have boys one and it smells really good. And I accidentally took it home with me, so I just gave it to Kyle. So yeah, I always get these whenever I go because they're so cheap and they just smell really, really good. Another thing from Bath and Body Works is everything's on the floor. The table's too far away. Um, is the Tahiti Island Dream White Sand Body Scrub and Body Cream. Can you even see that? They they gave me the the plastic and the ribbon, 
So I just put it in there. I, I can't be bothered. Can you see it? Anyway, it smells delicious. It smells really yummy. And it was buy three, get three free. So yeah, I bought a bunch. I'm definitely a bunch of coconuts. There they are standing in a row. Guys, I'm tired. You can't be bothered talking. Anyway, um, let's start off with these. Um, these are popcorn seasonings. So we have nacho cheese and white cheddar. I've never seen these before and I like fell in love with them. We went to the movies twice when I was in America. We went and saw Get Hard and The Avengers Age of Ultron, which are both really good movies. And they sell these in the cinema for like $1.50. And they're, they come in a container about this big and you sprinkle it on your popcorn for more flavoring. Um, we had the nacho cheese, but I got white cheddar as well, because why not? Um, I haven't used them yet. I don't eat that much popcorn, so it'll probably last a while, but I'm still covered. Doesn't smell like anything. <sighs> boom. Cookie butter. Double boom. Cookies and cream cookie butter. So I had the smooth one first, which is just like not in my range at all anymore because I found the cookie, I found the crunchy one and this one is so much better. And then now I think just after Dan left, they came out with this one, which is a cookies and cream, which is a swirl. Um, oh, this is so amazing. I got two of these and three of these. I wish I got more of these ones so good because I hadn't tried it so I wasn't sure if it would be good or not but this is actually really sweet but it's really good I am um, for breakfast I usually have a piece of toast two pieces of toast with one spread each so this one's a, sp a sweet spread made from crushed cocoa biscuits and cream filling oh my god so good also another thing coffee mate and creamers this jumper is too big but it was the smallest one they had um, coffee mate we don't have other flavors like this and it that annoys me because they have so many they've got like vanilla dolce de leche they've got coconut they've got peppermint and we just have original creamer so I got the coffee mate in the Girl Scout cookie edition which is the what are these things called again Ah, uh, there's a name for them, those biscuits that I've always wanted to try, but we don't have Girl Scout cookies here. Anyway, caramel and coconut creamer, and also the Dolce de Leche one, which is a um, caramel flavoured one, which I haven't tried any of these. Aji said this one was good. And I also got creamy chocolate for Mother Dearest, which she has now taken home with her. <laughs> that's my cereal. Cheese! So, I always get these two. I always get um, Cinnamon Toast Crunch and Lucky Charms, but these were three for nine dollars at CVS. So I got Cookie Crisp. Um, I hadn't tried them before. Dan said they were good. They're like mind blank. <laughs> um, cookies. Duh. Um, and they're really, really good. I like them. This is the only one I've opened so far. I don't want to open too many of ones, but... I've seen Community like a bazillion times, but I watched it on the plane on the way there, and they kept talking about Cookie Crisp. Um, but apparently it was a wizard before the wolf. And I was like, what the heck is Cookie Crisp? I thought they were just cookies, but nope, it's cookie cereal. <sighs> I think that's the end of my haul, guys. And I also got a ton of all these. I've four jars of chocolates and lollies around the house. I have like a big jar of mixed Hershey's ones. I've got the nuggets, the almond and toffee ones, which are my absolutely favorite. Um, and so is Archie's as well. I got almond M&Ms and a bunch of Werther's Original, which were only a dollar at the dollar store, Dollar Tree. So yeah, that's my whole video. Hope you enjoyed it and Bye.